The Victims of Communism Memorial Foundation is a non-profit educational organization in the United States, authorized by a unanimous act of Congress in 1993 for the purpose of educating Americans about the ideology, history and legacy of communism. The foundation was responsible for building the Victims of Communism Memorial in Washington, D.C. It is a member of the Platform of European Memory and Conscience. Topic. History In 1991, Senator Steve Sims and Representative Dana Rohrabacher introduced concurring resolutions in the United States Congress urging the construction of an international memorial to the victims of communism at an appropriate location within the boundaries of the District of Columbia and for the appointment of a commission to oversee the design, construction and all other pertinent details of the memorial." In 1993, Rohrbacher and Senator Jesse Helm sponsored amendments to the Friendship Act of 1993 which authorized such construction. The act was signed into law by President Bill Clinton on December 17, 1993. The act cited, "...the deaths of over 100 million victims in an unprecedented imperial holocaust," and resolved that, "...the sacrifices of these victims should be permanently memorialized so that never again will nations and peoples allow so evil a tyranny to terrorize the world." According to Title IX, Section 905 of Public Law 103-199, an independent organization was to be established to construct, maintain and operate the Victims of Communism Memorial in Washington, D.C., as well as to collect the contributions for the establishment of the memorial and to encourage the participation of all groups suffered under communism. In 2007, the Foundation completed the Victims of Communism Memorial, which was dedicated by President President George W. Bush, in 2016, the foundation released a list of 51 prisoners of conscience in Cuba just before President Barack Obama's visit and meeting with Raul Castro. Topic. Programs Topic. Victims of Communism Memorial The memorial was dedicated on June 12, 2007. The 20th anniversary of President Ronald Reagan's Tear Down This Wall speech in Berlin. The unveiling of the statue in Washington, D.C. earned international press attention. The land was a gift of the U.S. Parks Service, and the remaining cost, over $1 million, was raised from private sources. Sculpted by Thomas Marsh, it is a 10-foot bronze replica of the papier-mâché Goddess of Democracy statue made by student democracy protesters leading up to the Tiananmen Square massacre in 1989. Topic. Museum The Foundation aims to build a museum in Washington, D.C. The Foundation is working on a proposed budget for a museum near the National Mall, and has received a $1 million grant toward the museum from the Government of Hungary. Plans for the museum include exhibit space, an auditorium, archives, and resident scholars. Topic. Truman Reagan Medal of Freedom The Foundation annually presents its Truman Reagan Medal of Freedom at an event which honors opponents of communism, and has been used to raise funds for the construction of the memorial. Past recipients include Miroslav Marinovich, Chen Guangcheng, Tom Lantos, Pope John Paul II, Václav Havel, Yang Jianli, Fr. Nguyen Van Lee, Yelena Bonner, William F. Buckley Jr., Richard Pipes, Guillermo Farinas, Lane Kirkland, Armando Valladares, Janos Horvath, Lech Walesa, Anna Walentinovich, National Endowment for Democracy, and Henry Scoop Jackson. Topic. Other projects 
In 2015, the Foundation released a biopic video series called Witness Project, featuring interviews with witnesses of communism. Topic. People The chairman is Lee Edwards. Its chairman emeritus was Lev Dobriansky, deceased. The National Advisory Council includes Dennis Dickensina, Paul Hollander, John K. Singlaub, John Earl Haynes, and George Weigel. Former deceased members include Robert Conquest, Richard Pipes, Rudolf Rummel, and Jack Kemp. The International Advisory Council includes Sally Barisha, Vladimir Bukovsky, Emil Konstantinescu, Mart Lahr, Vitatas Landsbergis, Guntas Ulmanis, Armando Valladares, and Lech Walesa. Former members include Yelena Bonner, Brian Crozier, Arpad Gonch, and Václav Havel. Topic. See also Memorial Society Museum of Communism, Czech Republic Museum of Communism, Warsaw Virtual Museum of Soviet Repression in Belarus